Hello y'all, Pure Toxic here, and where have I been for the last couple of weeks or months or however long it's been since I made a video? I'm not even sure at this point. Uh, I know I've been, I guess, gone for a bit, not making any streams or videos at all, really. I am well aware that I've been slacking, and as I always say, I want to st start making daily content again, like I used to. But, yeah, it's just, I haven't been feeling like recording at all, really, or editing. And uh, I guess there's a few reasons for that that I'm gonna bring up here. I'm not gonna go into that much detail on some of the things. First of all, I'm gonna be honest, I've not been super well mentally. I've had a long period of time where I've been feeling really, really down and depressed. Longer than usual, and worse than usual, but... I'm aware of it, so I do my best to take care of myself mentally, but I don't want to get into too much detail about that stuff, because it's very personal and I'm not comfortable talking about it. But that's not the only thing, uh, also I've spent a, a lot of time actively looking for a job, because I really do need one, I need a good income, or at least a better income, so I can pay for the things that I need to pay for, really, and also treat myself to the, to like, do my hobbies. So that's been taking up a lot of my time, um, but also one big reason I haven't been especially editing videos is I've had a lot of issues with my external hard drive, it's just some days it doesn't want to work at all, and sometimes it works just fine. That wasn't super good. Sixth. Ah. Uh, that's fine. Sometimes it's working fine without any issues at all, like today. So I decided to sit down and uh, make this video. Another thing, I guess, reason why I haven't been editing or recording is I'm. I've been doing a lot of thinking, and that comes back to my uh, mental health stuff because I've been getting back into working out and meditating a lot because I, it just makes me feel better mentally, I suppose. And I've been uh, doing a lot of thinking about my YouTube stuff and my Twitch stuff a lot. Like, I never had any plans on making it big or, you know, having this as a career. Of course, I thought about it and it'd be cool to have my, I guess, hobby of this to generate income for me, that would be awesome. But it's never really been a goal of mine, I suppose. And I have honestly lost a lot of motivation to do it. I still enjoy it, but I've just not been motivated to do it. Some days I'm like, hell yeah, let's fucking sit down and record and make a video and edit and stuff. But usually there's always something that comes up that makes me unable to do that and then I just lose interest completely and uh, I don't want to do it anymore. And I've also not been happy with my editing, like I don't really know what kind of content I want to make. I know I want to do gaming stuff because that's definitely my biggest hobby and my biggest interest. Uh, but. I just don't really know how I should make gaming videos, like how I should edit them or stuff like that. I guess it's, it feels a little hard to explain, but hopefully you'll. Oh, whoa, 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 ow. Oh, that was a bad hit. Hopefully you get my point. I might have to restart actually, but I'm gonna go into the pits and see if I can deal with this damage. Whoa. So, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna do some more meditating on the kind of content I want to make and where I actually wanna go with this YouTube and Twitch thing. Ooh, we're a little fast, aren't we? Um, because, I'm gonna be honest, sometimes, a lot of the time, actually, I've been 
actually thinking of just stopping doing it. But I know if I would completely stop making videos and stuff, I would regret it after some time. It might not be instantly, but but I would definitely want to get back to it and just deleting my YouTube and Twitch and stuff, that, that would be a stupid idea. I've actually had plenty of people say, both in my streams and in the comment section of some of my videos, that they would want to see more vlogs from me, because apparently those are entertaining. Which, yeah, I put a lot of time in the editing and stuff in my vlogs, because those are really fun to make. And they're not that difficult. Sometimes they are, but they're not super difficult to edit in a way that I feel satisfied about. We're still having engine troubles, because this car should be able to go a lot faster, so I might actually have to restart, so this race can be interesting. Let's see, can we reach 170? Because I should be able to do that. No. Doesn't seem to... Yeah, you know what? I'll just fucking restart this race. And uh, honestly, like, yeah, I would do more vlogs. I just don't have anything to vlog at the moment, because y'all know what times we're in these stupid corona times. It's not the best thing to be outside and socialize and do stuff like that. Not the smartest idea, and uh, not I'm not a very social person in general, so just doing that would <laughs> uh, it's not it's just not gonna happen. Although I would make car vlogs, even if I didn't have anything to vlog at home, because at home like there's really nothing I'm doing. I'm just watching YouTube, playing games, uh, taking care of my apartment looking for a job, uh, taking care of my mental health. That's about it. And uh, that's not really anything that I could make into a decent video. Uh, but as I said, I could be doing car vlogs. The problem is, I think I've said it many times in both videos and live streams that my cars, neither of them are working right now and they haven't been for a while. And I just haven't been able to afford fixing them. You know what, this camera angle is really annoying, let's do this. So, and I really miss driving. Like, it's the thing that I enjoy doing the most. It's very therapeutic for me and I just feel better when I'm in a car. But that just hasn't been a possibility for me. We gotta stay up top, huh? I wanna get down below there so I can draft off of them. I can go behind the Red Bull. Oh yeah, just a little side note on the game here. If you know NASCAR, you know that none of the cars that I'm racing against right now are real. Um, NASCAR cars. <laughs> uh, I Most of these skins or paint jobs, except two, I have designed and made myself because I'm working on making a completely custom um, season with custom made cars for a stream or something. Possibly a video if that'd be interesting. Another thing that goes back to me, um, I guess, not feeling very well um, in general is I've actually, well, to make to start feeling better mentally i've cut contact with like a majority of the people i used to talk to in real life before not like discord friends or anything not my uh, clan uh, i try to keep contact with them as much as possible but you know i am garbage at being social unless i'm like drunk Pretty damn good at being social when I'm drunk. Uh, enough to feel embarrassed of myself, at least. <laughs> Which is, you know, most people feel embarrassed about how they act when they're drunk. But, you know, I don't speak for drunk toxic, and drunk toxic definitely doesn't speak for me, so. But yeah, I've cut contact with a lot of uh, old friends and just taken away old uh, text conversations and stuff with people that I. It, 
don't talk to anyways really anymore because I had a tendency of going back reading old conversations and being like oh yeah I remember this the I miss these times and then that makes me start feeling like shit because oh yeah that was a long time ago that's over now I don't have that type of relationship with these people anymore and then I just spiral down into feeling garbage which it took a surprising a long time for me to realize that hey buddy that's not very healthy of you to do <laughs> so I was like you know what the smartest thing I can probably do is make it me unable to feel like shit because of that so I just deleted a fuckload of old conversations and unfriended a bunch of people on different social media types to be like, you know what, it's probably pretty toxic for my mental health to keep these people around me. You gotta, everybody's gotta take care of their mental health. Uh, it's, in my opinion, an underrated thing to put attention into. On a more positive note though, uh, recently I actually managed to afford uh, and fuck knows how, but I managed to afford a, a VR headset, a what's it called, like m mixed reality, something mixed reality. It's not the best headset out there, like it's not a Valve Index or anything, but in my opinion, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna make this into a review video, I could do that do a different day, but it's pretty good. I, I like it. it. That VR headset is my first experience with VR at all, and I've become such a whore for VR now. Like, so much fun. I'm having my time, at the time of my life in gaming, playing VR stuff. Mostly I've been playing a lot of VR chat, uh, a lot of Pavlov, and a lot of Fallout 4 in VR. And Fallout 4 VR it's a lot of fun. I know people give that game shit for not being a good Fallout. But, I mean, I see the criticism, I understand most of it, most of the criticism, but... It's a game I really enjoy, I gotta be honest. And I have considered making videos of it. At one point I considered making a full like playthrough of it, but... I don't know. That's one of those games that I really just want to sit down and play myself. Oh, that's another thing actually, uh, completely off topic. Some things I have written down, some things that I wanted to talk about so I don't forget. But one thing is like when I start playing a game for videos or for live streams, especially like a story driven game. Oh, you asshole! Oh, come on. Ooh, fucking saved it. Um, yeah, when I do that, I don't want to go back and play it uh, by myself, like, when I'm not streaming, because I feel like, oh, maybe, like, this would be stuff that I want to do on stream, so even though I kind of want to play the game right now, I don't want to go in and, I don't know, get really far in the game or and then come back later on on stream and be like oh um, surprise you missed 10 hours of content that I could have been streaming but I wasn't because I was lazy you know I don't want that to happen and sometimes that just ends up with me not playing the game at all which is uh, completely off topic by the way but I'm rambling, so <laughs> something I just wanted to say. But yeah, VR stuff, back to that. I'm planning, I guess, in my head to make videos of Pavlov, VR chat, and probably uh, Fallout 4 as well. Not 100% certain about Fallout 4, I might just stream that. If streaming while I'm doing VR won't kill my PC. Because there's a high risk of my PC not being able to handle that. I tried recording some uh, Pavlov earlier today, and I mean, it, it ran okay, 
I had some internet issues, but I think that was on Pavlov's side, not uh, my PC's or my internet's side, but I'm not sure. Uh, and I had some technical difficulties, but it's nothing that I can't fix. Shit, I'm gonna have to go into the pits, aren't I? Third position. Wow, I thought I would have lost a lot more positions there. Yeah, I don't need new tires. So, yeah, VR stuff definitely coming out on the channel. Hi, Pure Toxic while editing here. I just went through the footage and I just realized that in the middle of a sentence, the recording stopped. Because in the game, I have F9 set to checking what is gonna happen in the pit stop. But F9 also decides when I start and stop recording. And that's something I didn't think about, but I don't remember and I don't think I said anything too important there at the end. Uh, I came 6th in the race, if anybody cared. No, wait, I came 8th, because right at the finish line, I spun out into a wall. And two guys passed me and I spun around in a circle, basically doing donuts into the finish line. By accident but I didn't really see anything of importance I don't think I got most of my points I wanted to make out most of the things that I had planned to talk about out so I'm just gonna end the video here and uh, I hope you enjoyed watching it and if you did go and leave a like and subscribe while you're at it if you want to see more of my shit but until next time have a great fucking day oh and don't get arrested yeah like we go move out the way please don't be a hero bling blow she no skateboard free bling blow she no skateboard free yeah going eight like we go move out the way please don't be a hero bling blow she no skateboard free oh bling blow she no skateboard free hey yeah made that money on a monday yeah ratchet bit on a runway